What is going on, Power Pals? My name is Chris, and you're watching the Kapow channel. Okay, so today I will be opening up this Pokeball tin. Uh, it comes in two different designs. It comes in the Quick Ball and the traditional Pokeball style, which you see here. Uh, in England, I believe it is going to be worth $13.99 everywhere. So, um, I'm not too sure if it's a, a bargain or not, but I'm hoping we're going to find out today if it's worth the money. By the way, I have a Harry Potter hat on. It was made for me as a Secret Santa at work, so thank you very much, Kelly, for that. Okay, so today let's get into this. Okay, so this is the first time I'm actually opening one as well, so it's gonna be interesting for me too. Okay, so we get three boosters and a Pokemon coin right there. It looks like Deoxys there. Okay, and the booster packs we have is Crimson Invasion, Breakthrough, and Burning Shadows. Okay, I'm excited because I love Burning Shadows quite a lot. I've got my card protectors and, well, and also sleep protectors as well. Right, I'm going to leave Burning Shadows to last, Crimson Invasion second to last. I'm going to start with Breakthrough. So, let's hope we get something good. Oops, the breakthrough pack is literally falling apart. I didn't think they were as, as well made as the uh, Sun and Moon were because they just seem to fall apart very easily. Okay, I believe it is three from the back. I'm trying to feel, yeah, three. Let's go for three. Okay, right, so we got Super Rod, Rumble. Uh, Pillar Swine, uh, yeah, Pillar Swine, Remoraid, Axu, got amazing final evolution for that Pokemon, and uh, Paris, Snubber. okay, so the reverse is Magneton, I believe that's rare, and the last card is Holographic, ooh, Empoleon, yeah, that's holographic, so I believe it's holographic. Yeah, it is. Okay, let's put that in a sleep protector. Okay. Right. Not too bad to start off with. Go for Crimson Invasion. By the way, hope you like my Christmas tree in the back. I thought I would feature uh, my Christmas tree in a video. Uh, seeing as no one's in the house as well, uh, I've got an opportunity to film downstairs. But anyway, let's start with Crimson Invasion. Crimson Invasion actually is quite a good one for me. I've got a lot out of it and same with Burning Shadows. Burning Shadows wasn't too bad either. But this one is four from the back so move those cards over there. Okay. Lightning. Didn't do the Guess the Energy game. Sorry I forgot about that. I uh, hope you got it right. Okay. It's a good card so far. There's an Avon there and the Star U. Jungle Mo. Phoebus. Hashtag Phoebus Patrol. And the final card is a GX. An Alone Executor GX. Fantastic. That's an amazing result. Let's put that in there. And that will go into the card protector. Fantastic result. We've got a GX from our Pokemon tin. There we are. Good result. Okay, and the final one, the Burning Shadows. I pray that we get something good in this one because it's been a while since I opened Burning Shadows. And I don't know, I just prefer Burning Shadows in general. I think I like the, the booster pack design quite a lot as well. Okay, so four from the back. Let's start. Oh, we've already got it there. Sorry, forgot it again. Okay, we've got Salt Rock. Let's put, sorry, move those cards over so they're not in the way. Okay. Lone Grimer, Lady Bar, uh, Cutie Fly, Horsey, uh, Venipede. Yeah, Venipede. Okay, the reverse. We already have that one. And the rare. 
is a non-holographic lichen rock. So, unfortunately, we didn't get anything good for that one. But we did successfully get a holographic and a GX card. So, that isn't actually uh, a bad find in this Pokeball. So, um, we also have a lovely Pokeball tin, which um, I'm sure I'll try and find some use for it. Um, I quite like the uh, look it's in China. I quite like the look of it. It's got a metallic sort of look to it. I mean, it shows better in there as a look more vibrant red. But um, when you hold it, it's a bit more of a richer red. Um, but yeah, I, I quite like that. And I'm guessing this is how big Pokeballs might be uh, if Pokemon was real. So it's massive. Imagine throwing that. No, it... Yeah, it actually felt, it froze pretty well, it froze pretty well. Um, didn't actually shout anything, I was just an empty Pokeball, so. But uh, yeah, quite like the, De the Deoxys coin, so that will, uh, that's quite welcomed into my little collection, and that will go very well. Okay, so, uh, we have quite a few videos uh, to make. What I'll be also featuring is my Team Rocket booster packs, and I'll be putting it in a frame, and I will show you how you can do that at home. Uh, I also have another frame, uh, and doing the exact same thing, but with my Japanese packs. So we have the jungle here, we have the Team Rocket one there, the fossil one there, and I am looking for the base set one as well. So. I will be on the lookout for that as soon as I can. Um, I think this has been quite a good video. I'm going to open one more booster pack because I got it. Um, so I'm just taking the price off because, well, yeah. Um, okay, so it's a Celestial Storm. Um, yeah, I wasn't sure if the, um, the Pokemon Tim was going to be good enough so I made sure I had an extra booster pack just in case and I can't think of what else I'm going to open it so I'm going to open it now. So this is the first Celestial Storm uh, booster pack that I all have opened on the channel uh, so I'm quite looking forward to uh, seeing what we get. I've not seen any of the artwork before so it's going to be new for me too. So it's four from the back, I think there's an energy game so I'm going to say fire. Oh it is fire! One for one. Okay. Oh, a rainbow energy. This is a, a car that, or the the design of it actually is quite an old one. I think it goes back to Team Rocket. So I believe it's Team Rocket. Don't quote me on that. It might, is it Team Rocket? Might be Fossil, I can't remember. Yes, yeah, so I'm actually quite happy with that. Okay. And uh, Corbis. Yes, Corbis. I'm trying to remember. Oh, I'm reading the names back to front. Um, when you look at it, it's the right way around. But when I'm filming it, it's back to front. So it's very difficult to <laughs> remember what it is. But that's a Nuzleaf anyway. Uh, Sherbet. That's a Mudkip. I quite like the this artwork as well, actually. Well done. Welma. Looks like he's terrorizing a village. That's a weird one, right there. Okay, Spinarak, Combustion. Okay, and that's the reverse. And the rare is a non-holographic. Uh, Del, Del Mice, Del Mice, Del Mice. I think so. Um, uh, whilst we're also on it, for any of those comic book fans out there, I went into Forbidden Planet. Uh, whilst I was in London. Uh, if you haven't seen my YouTube, not my YouTube, my Instagram photos, uh, they are up now. Um, ha shout out to uh, my good friends Jess. Uh, I think it's uh, you. You spell it weirdly, Jessica, um, but J E S S I C three A's, and I think it's an underscore. I I'm not sure if there's anything else after that, but anyway, she sang really beautifully. At the uh, at a pub in London, it was her first gig, 
and yeah we got to do a bit of collaboration as you'll see in the photos I added uh, some caps um, sort of pictures into it so it looks like he was singing it was quite funny um, but yeah whilst I was there I also picked up myself a signed uh, Batman comic book signature is there I believe it was 11 99 for the comic book which is signed uh, it is signed by a guy called Jock who that's his signature name his actual name is Mark Simpson and he I believe he was the one who drew this I'm not too sure but he won 2012 best um, Stanley best artist of the year but I quite like signatures and yeah I quite like Batman as well so it was a good excuse to get it um, but yeah so that is everything for today which I'm going to be doing uh, the next video will be showing me creating uh, the the frame not creating the frame but making it all fit together so putting the team rocket boosters in the uh, the frame and then seeing what happens at the end I've done it for quite a lot of my booster packs the old vintage ones and it's a good idea and a good way to showcase your collection so I'll be doing that in the next video and also opening up uh, just the one Lost Thunder uh, booster pack so uh, yeah one more video to come <coughs> I uh, I wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year and yeah I hope it's a relaxing one anyway so that is all from me now and I hope you have a Merry Christmas all right don't forget to subscribe and of course like the video okay that is all from me thank you very much see you later and take care bye